we just have a lot of moisture. Oh, so much rain. Yeah, you can't go from point A to point B without getting rain on, it seems like. Uh, yeah, ground is wet. We're going to have more rain showers this evening, but there is some dry time. Okay. Finally in the forecast. Uh, it's going to come as early as tomorrow afternoon, so that's good stuff. But our March has been wet. Look at this. Over four inches of rain, our average for the full month. And we're about halfway through the month of March now. Is a little over three and a half, so we are just going and adding more rain on top of our totals already. And I suspect that we will have a pretty wet month here after I look at some of the forecasts for next week too. We will have more rain showers. Uh, look at things are lightening up so we're seeing not as intense rain. The steady rain is now pushing to the east of so Vancouver, Portland, Tigard over to Hillsborough. Uh, pretty dry at this time and we're going to see more dry time as we go into our Thursday. Again, heavy rain pushing through the central Cascades down towards Detroit, up towards areas like Government Camp at this time, likely rhododendron. Uh, and then if you're pushing off to the west areas, McMinn Bill seeing some spotty showers here too, and this is again traveling to the east and northeast with this big system here in the Pacific Northwest. So again, behind it, we are starting to see things dry on up. So that means for our Thursday, get this, we could finally get outdoors and stay uh, kind of out of that rain that we usually see in the Pacific Northwest. But it's not going to last long because we'll have another system kind of push right back in by the time we get into our Friday and Saturday. So heavy rains now nudging off to the northeast. We have about half an inch here in Portland already. A little more than that in Vancouver and Hillsboro and down towards McMinnville. But look at the coast. Over an inch of rain since midnight. About an inch and a quarter there for Tillamook as well as Newport. Not as heavy rain off to the northwest. And if you're on the east side of the state, things are looking a little bit better where you likely haven't seen any rain at all. We still have this flood watch out there until Saturday at 1 o'clock. So a little bit of a lag time from all the heavy rain and some snow melt. Again, this is the whole area from Longview down towards Salem. So some of those prone rivers are going to be seeing the rise over the next day or so. And then a flood warning for the Umatilla River here on the east side of the state near Penn Pendleton and stretching eastward. So uh, for you folks on that side of the state, be prepared for something uh, in that area. 34 degrees right now. Meadows, Portland at 54, 53 for Skamania, the coast at 49. Uh, Riverview this afternoon, we had those spotty showers on and off. You could tell that the Columbia is just looking really high uh, right now and still pretty overcast at this time. 7 to 9 o'clock, still some spotty showers, but mainly dry. Temperatures right around the 50s, 49 degrees by 9 o'clock. Again, some spotty showers, uh, but but I think we'll stay likely on the drier side of things. Here goes the rain and now it pushes off to the east. We get into tomorrow morning. Sally will have your updates for you, but it looks like a nice dry start to the commute. By the afternoon, still some spotty showers around the area, but most of us should be, again, seeing some sunshine, just some passing clouds and a little bit of blue sky out there. Uh, here's by Friday morning. Clouds are back at us and we'll see more rain by Friday afternoon and evening more drenching rainfall by Friday evening. So we can't get away from the rain. We'll see it return Friday and Saturday to kick off the weekend. But if you have plans on Sunday and Monday, look mm -hmm. at that. We'll be nudging towards 60 degrees. Yes. First day of spring is going to be feeling like that. Yay. Look at that. And, and, you know, basketball March Madness starts tomorrow. Yeah. So with all this rain, stay indoors. Stay Something indoors. To do. Enjoy it. Get the big screen. Not Thursday. It looks nice out. Thursday, go for a hike. Enjoy <laughs> it. But then watch TV. <laughs> yeah. A lot of people will probably just stay inside. Up next at 5.